Hello everybody and welcome back here to our Ajax FM 22 beta series. Today we are kicking it off. We are taking on PSV in the Johan Cruyff Schau. It's the Dutch Super Cup. Can we kick off the season with some silverware? Hopefully we can, but before we jump into this game, we have sold a couple of players. So if we go over here to our transfers and go to transfer history, we have sold Zachariah Labiad to Sochi for 1.7 million. His contract was expiring at the end of the season. He was a backup player. He was not going to get very much time, if any at all, really. Uh, in his time here at Ajax, he has been quite injury prone, so we sold him off to uh, the Russian club for 1.7. And the second player is Nusir Mazwari. We sold him to the new big spenders, Newcastle United, after, of course, they got taken over by the Saudis. Sold him to the Magpies for 11.25 million. Another player whose contract was going to expire at the end of the season. He had no interest in renewing his contract. So we have moved on from him. He would have been our starting right back. But now it is time for one of our youth players to step up. And more on that in just a moment. But here's a quick look at how preseason went. And it went quite well. Got victories on all our matches except our latest friendly, which was against our toughest opponent by far. That was a 2-1 defeat away at Liverpool. So all in all, a pretty good preseason. Getting our players familiar with our tactics and how we want to play. But here is how we are going to be lining up against PSV in this opener. Stecklenburg in goal. Tagliafico and Devine Wrench at left back and right back. Wrench is going to be our starting right back at the moment. But we could see Timber moving over to right back if we want to play Alvarez or Schurz uh, as one of our starting center backs. We'll just have to see how things develop throughout the season. Uh, but our two starting center backs for today are Martinez and Timber. Midfield, Gravenberg, Klassen, and Burkhaus in the number 10 role. That leaves Anthony and Tadic on the wings. And Haller to lead the line. Daly Blend did pick up an injury just before this game. He was probably going to be our starting left back. But that injury was going to keep him out for a few weeks. So Nico has an opportunity to claim that starting position. And here we are, about to kick off the season. A little TV presentation here, going over the teams. PSV playing a classic 4-4-2. We'll see if they cause us any problems. But we are underway here at the Johan Cruyff Arena for the Johan Cruyff Schal Ajax vs. PSV. First highlight, it is going to be a free kick on the edge of the box. Dusan Tadic to take it. He fires it in there past the keeper. We saw what he could do from free kicks last episode, and he does it here once again. The keeper had no chance at stopping that one. 1-0, one and we're straight into another highlight. PSV looking for an equalizer just a few moments later. Come on, boys, let's not do this. What a save by Stecklenburg. The ageless wonder. He's like fine wine, making a huge save there. And we defend the corner. Steven Berghaus looking to break, and that is a tactical foul from PSV, and they somehow escape a yellow. But we are straight back into a highlight off of that free kick. But Ajax here, we turn it over. A lot of action going on here in this game. And PSV are looking to bring the, the fight to us and get that equalizing goal. But we deal with it here and now we are looking to create an attack of our own.
Laying it around back, looking for an opportunity, and Stecklenburg turns it over. That is not what we want to see, but Gravenberg wins it back. Oh my gosh, what are we doing? Stecklenburg with another turnover, and this time PSV capitalize. It is all tied up here. 26 minutes gone. What is he doing? Wow, that is a very poor goal to concede. And we are all even. We got to respond now. Corner for Ajax. Tadic whips it in. PSV deal with it. But we pick it up and we're looking to get it back in the box. Looking for some options here. Anthony has it on this right-hand side. Oh, that was a very well-timed tackle. And actually, it's being reviewed by VAR. Are we about to get a penalty? No penalty. That is a corner for Ajax. Or not. Maybe it was, but the highlight did not occur. And it looks like we're going to go in here to halftime. All even. One apiece. Uh, a very even first half. I feel like we edged it just a little bit, but we gifted them that equalizing goal. So a big 45 minutes coming up. First highlight here of the second half. It's a goal kick from PSV, and it's played right to Nico. Come on, boys. Uh, all right, Nico wins it back. Looking for options here. He plays it over to Berghaus, plays it in the Gravenberg, who has a shot, and what a goal! Ryan Gravenberg have a bow son. What a strike. Wow, he curled that in. Upper 90. Top of the box. Wow, that could be a goal of the season contender already. And just our first game of the season. What a hit. Going to make our first two substitutions of the game. Mohamed Kudis and Schurz coming on for Klassen and Martinez respectively. Both of them on yellow cards. And Martinez not quite up to match sharpness. As he returned late to preseason due to an extended holiday. Corner here. Tadic to whip it in. He's looking for Schurz, but he heads it just over. And let's go ahead and make some more substitutions. Nera's on for Anthony. And Darame on for Berghaus. And we'll put Tadic down the middle there. Uh, we have one more substitution. And we're going to look to hold on to that for a little bit longer. Oh, it was a corner for us. I, I missed it as I was doing some opponent instructions. But it is dealt with by PSV. The highlight is continuing here, and we win it back. Looking for a third goal. And if we could get that third goal, I think we would have enough to get the victory here today. But it is still just a one-goal game, and it is into the final 15 minutes. Great uh, tackle by Tagliafico. Looking to get that third goal. And there we go. Dusan Tadic is second of the game. El Capitano firing us home here. And I think we have one hand on the trophy now. One hand on the shawl. Just 15 more minutes and victory is ours. Another highlight here, PSV still looking to bring the fight. They're not giving up yet, but we're doing well to repel their attacks, and we're looking for a, th for a fourth, and what a hit by Muhammad Kudos, the substitute coming on, and what a strike. Two very good goals from our midfield today. Wow. Beautiful goal. And let's go ahead and we'll make our final substitution. 
we are going to bring on Edson Alvarez. He had pretty much no preseason. He didn't feature in any of our friendlies. He returned after all of those were played. So he's only been back with the club for a couple of days due to his extended holiday because of his international duty with Mexico. And there is the full-time whistle, a 4-1 victory for Ajax to kick off the season, and the Johan Cruyff Schall is staying in Amsterdam as Ajax lift the trophy, let's go, winning silverware in our very first game with the team. Lovely stuff here. All right, we are back for the second game of the episode, kicking off the Era de VC, and we're going to be taking on NAC Nijmegen. Just one change to the lineup. Edson Alvarez comes in place of Yari and Timber, but let's go ahead and we'll get this one underway. It should be a nice three points going to Ajax to kick off the season. Anything less is a disappointment. And here it is. The opener for the Eredivisie. Ajax vs. NAC. And we are underway here. Gone Ajax. Early highlight. Ajax off of a throw in. But they, uh, they win it off of us here. Bit sloppy from us off of that throw in. Not really doing anything with it. Let's press them into a mistake here, boys. They do a long ball over the top, and it is won by Alvarez. Now Burkhaus up on this right-hand side. He whips it in for Haller, and Sebastian Haller opens up his goal scoring on the season. 1-0, just under five minutes gone. Great ball in by Burkhaus, and Haller heads it home. Let's go. Another highlight and another opportunity for Ajax. Burkhaus has his shot blocked, but the danger is not over yet. You're coming at him strongly here, and it's going to be whipped in again by Tagliafico, and Burkhaus really should have got a goal there, but he heads it wide. Well, a free kick for NSA. But we deal with it nicely, and Anthony now looking to counterattack. Oh, we're, that wasn't the best pass, but we're still on it here. Wrench plays it in, and Burkhaus. Wow, this time he hits the post. He cannot get a goal at the moment. Should have had two. But now it's a corner for Ajax. Tadic whips it in, and Edson Alvarez gets the goal. 2-0. A uh, highlight here, just before half time. Can we get a third one? It's looking very likely. And Sebastian Haller. Wow. Okay, there it is. It crosses the line eventually. Hits both posts, but it dribbles over the line. Three nil. Davy Klassen picking out Haller. Look at that. I thought it was not going to cross the line, but it finally goes over. 3-0, completely dominating him here. And there is halftime. They haven't had a single shot on goal. We've had 20 shots, 9 on target. Actually, they haven't had a single shot at all. Talk about domination. Let's continue that here in the second half. Come on, boys. Finally, a highlight here in the second half. Up 3-0 still, looking for a fourth goal. Wrench on this right-hand side. Can he whip it across? He does. He was looking for Berghaus. Headed away, but we are straight back on the ball. This time across in by Tagliafico and Haller. Not able to get his hat trick. He hits the crossbar. Let's go ahead and make some substitutions here. I know there's a highlight, but let's go ahead and make some subs. So let's start. We're going to bring on our young left back, Salah Ediani. Don't know how to say his name. I apologize. Definitely butchered that second part. But 
on he comes. Also going to bring on Neres for Anthony. And what else? Let us bring on another youngster, Max Deval, for Steven Berghaus. And we'll do that triple substitution. And we'll hold on and make uh, our final two substitutions a little later on. Ah, uh, yes, and there is the highlight that we were waiting on. NSA on the ball. Can they do anything with it here? Well, that is a great ball. That cut our defense wide open, but great job getting back. And I think that was Tagliafico for his last contribution. There is the full-time whistle. It ends 3-0. All three goals coming in the first half. Definitely took our foot off the gas in the second half. Could have gotten ugly if we uh, didn't do that. But what a fantastic way to kick off the season. Winning the Johan Cruyff Schall and a 3-0 victory in the league. But that is where this episode will be coming to an end. No idea where we'll be coming back for the next one. It's going to be a surprise. One that I don't even know. If you have enjoyed this episode, make sure you leave the video a like down below. And if you are new to the channel, go ahead and subscribe and hit that notification bell. And until next time, it's been your Boyd147.